Hello everyone, in this video we will solve this interesting math question Integral of cos inverse x dx is equal to what? So it is an interesting question So how to solve this calculus question? But first of all, remember that we know that derivative of cos inverse x It will be 1 over square root 1 minus x square we know that derivative of cos inverse x it will be 1 over square root 1 minus x square but integral of cos inverse dx is equal to what so how to solve this question so if you want to solve this question first of all remember that this formula uh, integral of u b dx is equal to what so we know that integral of u v it will be u integral of b dx minus integral of derivative of u and here is integral of b dx so if you if you follow these rules so you can easily solve this question i mean integral of cos inverse x dx is equal to what so in this case i can see easily cos inverse x it will be u and what is the value of v in this equation so i can see easily here is v is one so according to this rules, I can say here is u is equal to cos inverse x and b is equal to 1. So if I put bo both below in this formula, so I can see easily here is u. So u and this u is cos inverse x and this b here is 1. So I can say u, u is cos inverse x. So cos inverse x and integral of b dx so b is 1 so i can see easily it will be dx minus and here is integral of and here is derivative of look u we know that u is cos inverse x and here is uh, integral of b dx b is 1 so here is dx so at this moment i can see easily and here is cos inverse x okay cos inverse x and integral of dx it will be x okay minus and in this case i can see easily <clears throat> derivative of cos inverse x it will be 1 over square root 1 minus x square times and we know that here is uh integral of dx it will be x and here is dx so we write down here is dx okay now at this moment I can see easily this equation becomes here is x this x and here is cos inverse x minus and in this case I can see it will be integral of x times 1 it will be x over square root 1 minus x square and here is dx so we'll find out this below I mean this side it will be x cos inverse x but integral of x over square root 1 minus x square dx is equal to what so how to solve this question so in this case uh, I can see easily here is look integral of ax and here is square root 1 minus x square and we write down here is dx okay so in this case uh, we are let look we are let let uh, 1 minus x square 1 minus x square is equal to z so we are write down here is 1 minus x square it will be z so i can say derivative of 1 it will be 0 and minus x square it will be minus 2x dx and it will be dz uh, i can see silly. in this case look uh, derivative of z it will be dz by dx so if i multiply minus 2x by dx it will be minus 2x dx so i can see easily here is x dx it will be dz over minus 2. so at this moment if i put this below in this equation so i can see easily it will be integral of look x dx we know that x dx it will be minus dz over 2 and square root will let 1 minus x squared will be z so i can say here is z yes now at this moment i can see easily 
integral of look here is minus dz over 2 and it will be 1 over square root z so i can see easily if i move on this 1 over 2 uh, outside the integral so i can see it will be minus 1 over 2 and here is integral of dz over square root z then i can see easily here is minus half and integral of dz over square root z is equal to 1 so we know that it will be 2 square root z and here is plus c so at this moment i can say this to this to cancel and we're find out here is minus square root z plus c but remember that z is equal to 1 minus x square so if i put this below in this case we'll find out minus square root 1 minus x square plus c so we'll find out uh, integral of x over 1 minus x square dx it will be minus square root 1 minus x square plus c now we are put this value or this equation here is so i can say it will be x cos inverse x minus and we'll find out integral of x square root 1 minus x square dx it will be uh, minus square root 1 minus x square plus c so i put this value in this equation so it will be square root 1 minus x square plus c so this is our final answer in this calculus question so thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel and like this video for other interesting video goodbye take care